those disruptors really work. Hey guys and welcome to another Star Wars Battlefront 2 guide. In this video I am taking a look at the MTT. The MTT, or Multi Troop Transport, was used by the Confederacy of Independent Systems during the Clone Wars in order to transport huge numbers of battle droids into battle, as well as provide a frontline assault for attack. Using battle points collected by getting kills or objective play, you can take control of the MTT. But like the AT-AT in Battlefront 2015, the MTT is on rails, so you are given control of the main guns. I could rarely get a kill with any of the main guns, but a friend of mine during the beta reached the top of the leaderboard with only an MTT, so in the right hands the MTT could be incredibly deadly, I'm just not the right. The MTT has three abilities to assist it in battle. The first is Linked Fire. This fires all four heavy blasters simultaneously for a short time. This is very useful against enemy ATRTs as they're quick, but the amount of damage that all four do at the same time is enough splash damage to hopefully destroy the ATRT. Next is called Refresh, which resets the ability recharge times of all allies near the MTT. So if one of your friends is in the MTT or an ally, make sure to stick by the MTT because it might refresh you and give you your star cards back. And the last ability is a large radius scan pulse, which reveals enemies for you and your teammates. This is useful for finding a clone with an ion disruptor. If he's hiding behind a wall, you can pop a scan pulse and your friends will know where to attack this clone so the MTT does not get destroyed. The part of Galactic Assault on Theed I would recommend picking the MTT during is the last stretch of the first phase. This is when the MTT is closest to the palace and the clones start spawning inside of it. So you can pick them off the palace steps with your heavy blaster cannons. But maybe on Kashyyyk there will be another point where the MTT can be used and maybe there is another point where you can get lots of kills with it. But we don't know that yet, the game isn't out. But when it is, I will be sure to bring that information to you. But that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And until the next video, may the force be with you.